Hi schoolmates! Para sa selebrasyon ng National Children's Month, ating bibisitahin ang isa sa mga Discovery Museum at Resource Center ng Children's Advocacy Program, ang Museo Pambata. Ako si Gabayan at samahan niyo kong mamasyal at matuto sa Schoolmates Field Trip. Let's go! Ang Museo Pambata ay matatagpuan sa Ermita, Manila at binuksan taong 1994 ni Dr. Nina Lim Yuson, isang ina at early child educator. Ito ay hango sa napakagandang Boston Children's Museum sa Amerika na pinangarap din ni Dr. Nina, hindi lamang para sa kanyang mga anak, kundi pati na rin sa mga batang Pilipino na maranasan ang matuto habang naglalaro. Alright, schoolmates, sa puntong ito makakasama natin si Miss Maika Pinto para bigyan tayo ng dagdag kaalaman tungkol sa Museo Pambata. Miss Maika, bati ka naman sa ating mga ka-schoolmates. Isang magandang araw, magandang buhay sa ating lahat and welcome to Museo Pambata. Miss Maika, I've heard 100 years old na itong structure. Tama. So, bigyan mo naman kami ng konting historical background na itong uh, Museo Pambata. Okay. So, si Museo Pambata, um, well, being a private foundation, we have a very strong partnership with the Manila City Government. So, this property is actually public property. Um, and it's a hundred-year-old building. We're sitting on a heritage site. That's why you see um, in front, we have a marker that says it is a hi historical site. It used to be the um, building of the Elks Club. It was designed by William Parsons, an American architect. And um, si Museo Pambata started, was established in 93, but we opened the doors to the public in 1994. The logo is actually a Sorbet Arrow card because our founder, Ms. Nina Lim Yuson, believes that the kids learn best through the five senses. So, nakikita yung Sorbet Arrow card, yung naririnig mo yung tililing nung, um, nung bell, nakikita mo yung ice cream, naamoy mo siya, nahawakan mo yung apan, tapos natitikman mo. So, in the different spaces, you could actually touch, hold everything, and um, interact with the spaces. No? So, meron tayo dito, for example, you could smell the spices, and then in the karagatan, there are Um, fish scales na pwede mong hawakan yung texture. So, we continue to uphold um, the right, uh, yung protecting the right of a child to play while, to, um, while also advocating for their right to education. So, right to play, right to education. Museo Pambata is all about um, the Filipino child and childhood, nurturing, protecting, and empowering the children through active play and active learning. Currently, um, we don't have the second floor galleries open yet uh, due to the ongoing renovation. So we have opened um, sites, which is where we are currently in right now. It's called the Pamayanan, wherein we talk about um, Manila before. before. Um, so we have the Galleon, the Tranvia, and we're in the hero circle talking about Philippine revolutionaries. Um, and, an, uh, and another room is the Karagatan and the Kalikasan. So it mainly talks about uh, marine life, marine conservation. Kalikasan room talks about Mother Nature and also our indigenous roots relating to Mother Nature. And there's also rooms such as the Himig and Habi talking about um, Philippine culture through textile and instrument and an arts and crafts area. And then later on, this end of November, on the 27th, we'll be opening a new exhibition space um, in the Karapatan Hall. It's going to be entitled Kanluan Exhibit, focused on um, the rights of a child. Sa hangaring linangin ang pagkatuto ng mga kabataan sa pamamagitan ng paglalaro ay hindi maikakaila na marami ng parangal at pagkilala ang natanggap ng museo. Sa dami ng mga pangarap at hangari natin lalo na sa mga batang Pilipino, mahalaga rin na maimulat at linangin ang kanilang pag-iisip lalo na sa kasaysayan. It takes a village to raise a child. But it takes a, even a greater village to raise a community of children. So maraming salamat and kita kits dito sa Museo. Ayan guys, sobrang dami nating natutunan ngayong araw dito sa ating pagbisita sa Museo Pambata. Sana kayo rin, schoolmates. Muli, ako nga pala si Gabayan. Hanggang sa susunod nating pamamasyal at pagkatuto, dito lang sa Schoolmates Field Trip.